right guys here we are at boone hall plantation we're gonna go check it out see if it's worth your stop here in charleston So we just got our house tour booked. You do gotta go over here to get a house tour schedule. So like you can't just walk in if you wanna go tour the mansion over there. We got our set, it's about an hour. So we're gonna go check around on the grounds and see what else they have to offer here at Boone Hall. I think it's Boone Hall, anyway. Getting ready to go, and it would sound like this. Steal away, steal away, steal away to Jesus. Steal away, steal away, oh, I ain't got long to stay here. Matt, it almost sounded like he was on a, like a record. It was pretty good. Hopefully that got into the video, because it was really nice. Come on. I guess they don't want to be on YouTube. I guess the grass is better. All right, so we are walking through the gardens. I think we picked a great time over the flowers, because they are definitely blooming here in March I mean that could be the good thing about coming in Charleston uh, in March close to April it smells amazing of course if you're allergic to flowers it's probably not the best thing but I mean look at these the only thing missing the only thing missing is telling us what they are but they're absolutely beautiful I just imagine taking I love taking like your wife or someone here to this probably would be a nice place the only thing I said I think they missed they missed a mark on they could have had some wine tasting or something like a little place where they make wine or something uh, the Biltmore does that and I think it would be kind of cool this garden is pretty Apparently they do have actually tags on it telling what stuff is. I guess just not everything does. As in you can see over here, it says we got some kale and then some Mexican heather. Some other stuff it does have tags. If you enjoy strolling through gardens, this place is amazing for that it's got absolutely gorgeous ground you can see the size of that tree over there this area looks so crazy like i said this is my first time ever coming to charleston I'm just seeing this the way the trees hang over and stuff is just amazing i enjoy it So now on the Boone Hill Plantation, the house back here was actually, they told us, was built in 1935. It's not the actual house that was originally on the plantation. Uh, 
I guess a couple of houses that's been put up there throughout that time but it's not the original but still in 1935 they built this one because he wanted like a plantation life the original owner now you can't photo you can't take photographs or video in there so I didn't record that plus it'll be okay because you know you need to be able to see something while you're down here when you check this out You'll be able to see what's inside they said there's actually a family that lives in the top floor because they use it as a residential place and then they rent out the bottom to tours <laughs> boone hall plantation is also one of those places that you can get on the tour pass so if you're kind of planning on purchasing a tour pass you can check out boone hall you might enjoy it so right here is the boone hall plantation we showed you around so you guys can check it out if you're ever in charleston uh had a pretty good time it was nice i loved walking through the garden uh i think i'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up and i will see you guys in the next one peace out